Hey guys, and welcome back to Mad About Skin. In today's video, I'm putting to the test one of the most popular, hyped, and viral skincare hacks on the market. This has taken TikTok and YouTube by storm, and actually involves two of my favorite products, the Ordinary Matrixel and the Ordinary Azure Alliance Solution. This hack claims that using these two together can mimic the same results in the skin for tackling fine lines and wrinkles as Botox itself. This almost seems too good to be true, so I wanted to put it through its paces. Let's use this for 30 days and see whether there's any noticeable difference in those fine lines and wrinkles, and whether this affordable hack can actually give you the same anti-aging benefits as Botox itself. Sit back, relax, and let's put this hack to the test. Now, before we cut the waffle and delve straight into this hack itself, I do just want to cover a couple of things when it comes to Botox. You need to remember that Botox is one of the best studies and understood treatments for aging on the market. This has decades worth of scientific data to back up how effective it is. There are those people out there that say Botox can be great as a preventative measure to prevent the first signs of fine lines and wrinkles. However, for me, because it's invasive, it involves needles and a visit to the dermatologist, I kind of see it as more of an end game state in terms of my own skincare journey. I'm in my mid 30s and whilst I am seeing the first signs of fine lines and wrinkles, I'm quite happy tackling them with more topically applied products rather than reaching for Botox itself. I'm not anti-Botox and it might be something that I look to in the future, but at the moment I'm quite happy with the topical creams and serums that I use. This is why this hack appealed so much to me. Beyond just being a fantastic use of two products I already know and love. I use both of these in successfully in my own skincare routine. There's also some scientific data behind it as to why this one might actually work. So should we start, should we break it apart? Let's start with the Ordinary Azure Alliance solution. This is a 10% concentration of Azure Alliance, which is the trade name for a scorbal hexapeptide 3, which is a scientific name for a very specific peptide. There are loads of different peptides on the market and I love so many of them. In fact, I covered my favorites in a recent video, which I'm gonna link up there. But the Azure Alliance works in a very specific way. It almost mimics how the way that Botox works in terms of its mechanism of action. It disrupts the signals which are sent from the nerve to the muscle, which causes it to contract. Without, with those signals being blocked, it means that the skin can't contract in the same way, which will prevent dynamic fine lines and wrinkles. When we talk dynamic fine lines and wrinkles, we mean the ones that are caused by movement. So the laughter lines, the crow's feet, the forehead creases as we frown. These are all things, creases and lines which emerge over time as a result of facial movement. The Azure Line solution can minimize the amount of muscle contraction and so does almost mimic the way that Botox works. Now let's come on to the Matrixel 3000. So again, this is a peptide and a very specific peptide, but it works very differently to the Azure Line. The way that this works is it triggers the body to produce more collagen, elastin and hyaluronic acid. This is fantastic because collagen and elastin are what gives our skin that firmness, that elasticity and snapback that we tend to lose as our skin ages. Hyaluronic acid gives a little plumping to the skin, so the more that our skin naturally produces, the more plump our face will look, and so that'll just reduce the depth of any fine lines and wrinkles that we see. The reason this is very similar to Botox is when Botox is injected into a site, over a period of 30 days, it does also increase the rate of collagen, elastin, and hyaluronic acid that is produced in that area naturally by the body. And so again, the Matrixel is kind of mimicking the way that Botox will work in our skin. So in theory, if you apply these two together, you should get a similar outcome as what you would get with Botox. However, there is one big caveat that I do want to call out. The Ordinary Azure Line solution it is no way the same strength as Botox and as powerful as Botox when it comes to disrupting those signals sent from the nerve to the muscle to prevent that contraction and those dynamic fine lines and wrinkles. They work in a similar way, but the potency is nowhere near comparable. And so when I started out on testing these two things out together, I had in the back of my mind the knowledge that whilst it might mimic the results of Botox, you're not going to get the same overall look in terms of the rigid, that smooth skin, the reduction in the fine lines and wrinkles that you would get from Botox. And I just wanted to call that out from the start because I never think it's good to set yourself up for failure. So I combined these two products together and used them on my skin morning and evening for 30 days. And what were the results? Honestly, I was so, so impressed. Now the results weren't like game changing. Oh my God, everyone says, wow, Rob, have you had Botox? But I did definitely see a reduction in the fine lines and wrinkles, particularly around the crow's feet. I definitely noticed that my skin was a little bit more plump in the areas that I had applied it because I used it as a targeted treatment rather than an all over treatment for the face. And I was really improved with how smooth the skin looked in those areas. I've been using the Ordinary Azure Line for the past sort of three years. It's been one of my ride or dies. And so I think maybe the results I got were 
muted a little bit by the fact I'd already accumulated some of them from using that product. But the addition of the Matrixel definitely dialed up the results that you get. And in terms of this hack, I honestly thought it worked so, so well. For me, I say I saw about a 20% reduction in the depth of the fine lines and wrinkles that I've started to appear on my skin. And so I'd say this is a great thing. If you're thinking about maybe dipping your toe into the Botox market, this is a great hack to try first because you might actually be perfectly satisfied with the results that you get from this hack. And so you can delay the use of Botox for say five or 10 years to when you really need it. When the depth of those fine lines and wrinkles means that you want to reach for something a little bit more potent. I say whether you choose to try this hack out or go straight to the Botox is entirely up to you. I'm not here to influence you in any way, but I will say in terms of this hack, I'm going to give it 10 out of 10. Bearing in mind, I didn't go into this expecting those exact like for like results from Botox. I was really surprised with the level of smoothness, the reduction in the depth of the fine lines and wrinkles that I had, and the overall improvement in the texture of those areas. There is definitely science to back this hack up in terms of the way the Azure Align mimics some of the mechanisms of action of Botox, and the way the Matrixel can increase the rate of um, hyaluronic acid production, but also collagen and elastin production in the skin. Definitely one I would check out. And if you do want to get your hands on either of these products, I have linked them below with a code which will get you a little bit of a discount as well, because you guys know, even though the order at a drugstore to their core, it's always nice to get a little bit of an extra coin if you can. So check out the link below if you do want to purchase either of them. I would love to know if you tried this hack yourself. Were you sucked in by TikTok? Or what results did you get? Similarly, if you've tried Botox, I'd love to know how it impacted your skin and the results that you got. Whatever your choice in terms of tackling the aging in your skin, I'm here to support you. And I would love to know and hear from you in the comments. While you're down there, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and a like, because honestly, it supports me and the channel so much and I would love you forever. Wherever you are in the world, guys, stay safe, stay well, and love your skin. Take care. Bye.